enthusiast. Maybe you're watching this if you have a Lamborghini Huracan as well. But today, we're changing the game. Come with me and I wanna show you guys our newest development for the Audi R8 platform. Now, it's no secret that everybody loves to do exhaust systems on these cars. Everybody does the rear section and they make the car louder, but quite frankly, they all sound the same. Valtron designs with the innovation of our rear section with the large cross section X-pipe and our engineered muffler casings that have been designed and developed right here in Boyertown, Pennsylvania. Our setup definitely has an exotic flavor. Now the setup behind me is strictly for Audi R8 V10s and the 5.2 liter cars, as we know, there's a lot of different variations. You've got early Gen 1 and Gen 2 Audi R8s V10s, you've got Lamborghini Huracans LP580 610, and you have the STO Evo Technica as well. So behind me is the setup for the Audi R8 V10s. We do make a header configuration for the Huracan Evos, the STOs, Technicas, and such. So this same knowledge base and the engineering we've done on this platform is applicable to that. That's why we have the different versions. We have the Evo 2 headers and we have the Gen 1 R8 headers. In this video, we wanna showcase why this exhaust configuration is so special for the Audi R8s and the Huracans. The reason why is because I actually was fortunate enough to have one of these cars about three years ago when the development began and I had our first set of headers and the car sounded like this. You can tell it has a really exotic high pitched motorsport sound comparative to a traditional Audi R8 exhaust, even if you had other headers. There's other companies that make headers, you know, Secret Weapon Fab and stuff. The problem is, is those Secret Weapon Fab headers are $25,000. That doesn't account for install as well. Behind me, the headers are five grand. The rear section as well is five grand. It's a very expensive system and it does require about 20 hours of labor to put it in. But if you're gonna have your Audi R8 and you want the best exhaust setup, or if you have a Huracan STO and you wanna give your vehicle the ultimate sound, this is how you do it. You're gonna see later in this video about how exotic that sound is. But come with me and I wanna show you a little bit more in depth why this setup is so special. Now up front, the headers have been specifically tuned with the proper lengths to give that more motorsport, more exotic sound. What you see is you see the extended runner from the closest manifold position to the merge collector has been extended, as well as all these runners have been extended properly so you get that motorsport sound. That's the biggest thing that we went after with this platform for the 5.2 liter cars. We all know how special a five liter Gallardo sounds. Those cars sound so good. And these headers have been designed and engineered to give you that type of sound. These headers have been designed, engineered, and developed right here. We've got some other components we're working on in the background there, the Porsche GT4, but these headers are really, really special. It's something we're very excited to bring to the market, and we hope that more people will take the plunge to do a modification like this, because when I had my Audi R8 a couple of years ago, I put the exhaust on pretty much at the point I said, you know what, I'm gonna sell the car, uh, and then I put the exhaust on, and I was like, I'll never sell this car. It was so much more exciting, so special, so exotic, and so fun. The factory manifolds have massive heat shields on them, so what we do is we use this kind of Inconel shielding to help keep those temperatures low in that area. Merge collector comes together and then everything goes back unrestricted all the way out. Now this collector has been designed to funnel all five of those header runners into one so you get that exotic sound. Everything exiting at the same point is gonna give you that motorsport sound. You have your flex bellow here to give yourself some movement. So a lot of people who buy the headers are actually twin turbo the cars with their Huracan R8. So we have the flex sections there. The length of the titanium rear section is important as well. You can see this X-Pipe compared to some of the others on the market. The X-Pipe has a lot of cross section. If you look at the X from this angle, you can see the other side. So you get huge crossover, a lot of scavenging right here. And then the system runs out unrestricted to the sides when the valves are open. These are our pneumatic style valves and you can see they're spring suspended in the casing. So it doesn't matter how hot you get these, they're always gonna work for you and they're never gonna have any issues. Vacuum supplied and the controller's not here but you can use the factory exhaust controller in the R8s, it's like the button for the Gen 2s, or you can use a standalone controller. System runs out unrestricted. We like to keep it as one outlet. There's other companies that split it. It's not the best thing for flow when the exhaust is exiting out of the bumper. We keep it single and you just get the three inch section out of the bumper. When the valves are closed, the sound is heavily, heavily decreased. On my car personally, I found that I actually ended up using the valves a lot more when I had the headers installed 
because when you bring those sound levels down, you can actually use the car, you can have people in the car, there's no drums, there's no unwanted frequencies, which is really, really nice. But when the valves are open, it's absolutely wild. I hope you guys enjoyed this little walk around of this exhaust configuration. Here in Boyertown, Pennsylvania, the company, we've been around now for about six years, and we may have started by just, you know, maybe relabeling other people's products, but now we are doing our own engineering and design work in-house here in Boyertown, Pennsylvania. The reason we're doing all this engineering and design work in-house is because we want the Valtronic name to last forever. We want to be doing our own engineering and our own developments so we can give enthusiasts like you the best experience. That's what's going to take us to the next level. And also, another piece of this is the price point and the availability. These headers and this exhaust is in stock, ready for you to buy. You can check with our team and reach out to us at Valtrank.com, but this setup's gonna be in stock for you. We know that someone might wanna buy this setup and they might only have the car for six months. The Valvetronic mission is to design engineer the product and make sure it's accessible for you, the enthusiast, so that you, when you wanna install it, can just buy it, it's gonna show up in a couple days and you can enjoy the ultimate experience. So behind me, we're working on Porsche GT4s. You can see one of those has been sprayed, we're 3D scanning it, just so we can make sure the developments we're doing are top notch and we're getting all the points right. At the end of the day, we are offering the best experience and we know that you guys will actually be able to enjoy the product rather than waiting six months for it. So take a listen now to this video, this red Audi R8. It's got the full exhaust setup. It is just wild with the headers. Enjoy, sit back and relax. See you on the next one. folks we are inside the audi r8 gt this does have as you saw earlier in the video our headers although it is a very very intensive job we're going to show you exactly in this video why it is a must-have modification for your v10 whether it's a huracan or an audi r8 like this this creates such a smooth exotic sound obviously you guys know from factory these cars sound fantastic but when you add those equal length headers, it absolutely changes the game. You guys can hear how smooth it is. We'll get some windows up for you guys as well. So smooth. You guys can hear the pops and cracks as well. Even at the two, three, four thousand RPM rev range, you still get that super exotic. Era. You get those whip cracks in the shifts as well. 
another R8. Got a show them what a real one sounds like. <laughs> <laughs> Enough talking. I'm gonna give you guys some just raw sound.